how did the Greeks find the radius of the Earth? And they did, and they did a pretty good job. So the basic idea is to look at shadows due to sticks on two different parts of the Earth. Because as the sun comes in and it hits a stick right here and a stick right there, that's going to cast different shadows. So let me put this down without dropping it and go to the board here. So this is the a spherical Earth. And it, this is the axis of rotation, so it's tilted. At some point, for some locations, you can make a stick where the sun coming this way, it casts no shadow. That, you don't have to have that, but it just makes it useful. Over here is another stick, and it does cast a shadow. The angle that that shadow makes is the same angle between a line from the center of the Earth to that stick and the center of the Earth to that stick. Now, if you just know the arc length, the distance between the two sticks, um, now that was the hard part for the Greeks because they had to actually just count the steps for a very far